Constitution, as you know, is the people's own law, which guarantees to them their lives, liberties, and precious freedoms. And they do not propose that it shall be lightly changed. And they have prescribed two parts, a proposal and a ratification. Proposal by two-thirds vote of Congress and ratification by three-quarters of all the states. The executive does not sign the resolution of proposal. And yet, in this present method, the proposal comes direct and solely from the executive. And it is proposed that Congress shall do the ratifying. And what is the mechanics? To place on the Supreme Court six young wreckers who, by shortcuts, would... The purpose of the Supreme Court bill is to change the Constitution, to make constitutional measures that are unconstitutional. As you know, the Constitution is the people's own organic law that guarantees to them their lives, their happinesses, their precious freedoms. They do not propose to see it lightly changed, and they have prescribed a definite method, one of proposal by two-thirds vote of Congress, the other by ratification of three-quarters of all the states. The President has, does not sign the resolution of proposal. And what have we with this present bill? Out of the blue, the executive makes the proposal and recommends that the Congress, by a bare majority, should do the ratifying. Usurpation, executive and judicial. And what is the mechanics? To place on the Supreme Court six young justices who are expected to vote measures constitutional that are unconstitutional. The advocates of this bill are no doubt sincere and conscientious, not realizing that they are raiders of the reservation, raiding the reserved domain of the people. They may think that they're good Americans, but they're not playing the American game of constitutional democracy. 